everybody. Today, we are celebrating a milestone in American history. Eight years ago, a small factory in Butler, Pennsylvania, the Bantam Car Company, took this vehicle to Camp Hullabird, Maryland, September 23rd, 1940, to be tested by the U.S. Army. This car is formally called a Bantam Reconnaissance Car, or BRC for short. But in everyday common slang, it was and still is called a Bantam Jeep. This is the first Jeep. In fact, it's the first car to ever be called a Jeep. It's the first Jeep to ever be commissioned into the U.S. Army. And it's the first vehicle to ever be in combat, used by the British in World War II in the North African campaign. The building of this vehicle is an amazing, magical story about how the men at Bantam went from concept to this car in 49 days, delivering it to the Army. The BRC itself is a classic example of timeless engineering design. Although this vehicle has gone through multiple changes over the years, it still looks the same. I can take this car to any elementary school and every kid there will call it a Jeep. Automotive historians have ranked the BRC as one of the most significant cars of all time, ranking only second to the Model T Ford. World War II generals George Marshall and Dwight D. Eisenhower called this vehicle one of the most significant weapons of modern warfare. So, old buddy, happy 80th anniversary. Happy 80th birthday. You're aging very well. Mm-hmm.